and helped us. And everybody, like, got some balls and stood, stood our ground. Um, yeah, what impressed you both most with Mike today? Uh, the way he just took over. He, he, played, he played confident. And he just took over and showed, showed who he really is. I feel like this is a big, a big game for Mike for his career. You know, we, he went through – it's a lot of pressure on him this year, being a senior and having his crazy losing, losing streaks and things like that. And today he showed he – today Mike helped, helped, helped the whole team with leadership before the game, yesterday in practice and during scout. Mike showed up big. <laughs> Was the uh, how, how did and how did this uh, celebration compare to the last one? Was it better? Uh, I mean, of course it'd be better because uh, they number seven, you know. But you know, we just just happy we won. You know, we've been winning, we've been losing all year, and any win for us is big because we've been losing all year. So it's feel great to feel great to win. I wish we didn't did this the whole year. Next question to Tim Fitzgerald. Hey, Dejuan. Um, how good was the defense tonight, and what exactly did you do to OU to give them so much trouble? Uh, our defense has, has been pretty good. You know, we've been stopping the half court. You know, uh, the last time we played Oklahoma, we stopped them pretty good in the, in the half court, but they had 23 points off transition and, and then the rest off our turnovers. So I feel like today we did a pretty good job in transition. We guarded them in half court. And you just got to uh, stop letting them get offensive rebounds. We don't, we don't let them get offensive rebound. The game, you know, will be further. And you went through this last year. How difficult is Coach Weber's defense to pick up in terms of all the, the helps and the switches and all the different things you have to know? Uh, it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty hard, once, like, when you first get here. But once you get here and just – know all the principles, it's kind of, it's like, it's easier, you know, it's like, it's helping, you're helping, you plan to help the next guy the whole time. So it's all about helping your teammate. Is it fun when you guys are helping like that? And I mean, there was some possessions there where, oh, you just couldn't get a clean look at the basket at all. Yeah, it's fun. We just scrambling, everybody just running, taking the next thing. It's just so fun. We communicating, everybody on the same page. And it, you see, we help us get the win. So. As long as we communicate and play, play defense and keep scrambling on the next rotation, it'll help us big time. Thanks, Tijuan. Appreciate it. Uh, next question to Ryan Black. Hey, uh, Dejuan, how much did your mentality kind of have to change now that you were back in the starting lineup after the last two games come off the bench? Uh, it haven't changed. It's the same thing as coming off the bench, you know. Just coming up, play hard, and uh, take what I take what I get, you know. So, still the same mentality, you know. Just coming off my foot, I couldn't really rebound that hard, that hard. So, but today, you know, I've been getting treatment with with our trainer, uh, Luke Sauber. He been helping me the most. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't even be out here to play, you know. So, same mentality, just play hard and you know take, take what the defense give us. Well, on that note, you know, you played 37 minutes. Were you expecting to be out there that much? Uh, I'm not sure to be honest. You know, last game I didn't play. I didn't play. Too, I played about uh, 19 minutes, and but the game before that I played a lot. But you know, I feel like Coach Weber. If I let Coach Weber know that I'm able to go, he gonna leave me in and um, believe in. And then day one, can you kind of describe how that last uh, the last bucket that you scored kind of played out? Because you drove and, and you capped that 11 0 run, but you drove and was like you kept waiting to see if he would jump or foul you, and you're like, okay, forget it. I'm just gonna put it up. Yeah, um, when I caught it, I went uh, try to go middle with uh, Davion fell and got hurt, so I tried. I didn't want to travel, so I just like did like a hop step over him and I did a pump fake to see if a uh, big guy would jump. And he like kind of jumped backwards, and I just laid it up. But if he would have jumped for it, I would have jumped into him. So, just reading what he do before I make my move. Hey, thank you so much, Dave. One. Thank you. Next question to Michael Goins. 
Yeah, Deshaun, you mentioned doing a lot of scrambling in this game. Did this come down to just kind of out scrapping Oklahoma and just uh, playing harder for loose balls and fighting for rebounds like you're good at? Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Just playing hard that helps. That give you a chance even to even win a game, no matter what your talent is or with the referees. Playing hard gives us everything. We play hard, dove on, dove on the floor. Rebounded well. Davion with all the uh, offensive rebounds, putbacks, saw a big time, you know. So playing hard helped us the most. And how far has that progressed over the course of the season, uh, just going all out on every play? Uh, it gave us a chance. We always – every game we played, we had a chance. Yeah, every game we played, we had a chance. You know, playing hard gave us that chance. You know, we just got to figure out. But what, what our team really, really are, like what we do well, that will help us win. And everybody's got to pick that role and keep going. It seemed like you guys were pretty quick to bounce back. Uh, you had a seven-point lead, and then they get up, I think, five or six. What was that mentality and your approach to just come back time and time again? Uh, don't be like last time. Last time we had them um, the whole game, almost the whole game. They came where well, we, like, you know, had them. They came back and won. Same thing as the year before we at at um at Oklahoma we had them the whole hat the whole game they went zone and we folded so our biggest thing coach been talking about was just don't fold you know Mike every time something happened Mike huddle us up to let us know that we okay we going we here. At what level of confidence do you guys have going to West Virginia for Saturday? Uh, same mentality as we always had. You know, uh, we always been we've been the underdogs all year. You know, so same mentality. Just got to go in there and play basketball. Thank you, Dave Schwann. Appreciate it. Okay, Dave Schwann, I think that's all the – oh, one last question for Ryan Black. Okay. Hey, hey Dave Schwann, I just want to jump back in for a second because you, you mentioned that, again, that the play where you last scored was was where Dave Schwann uh, – where, where Davion got hurt. I guess uh, – I guess did you see what happened and then how was he doing in the locker room? Uh. No, I didn't. I really didn't see what happened. I was too focused on trying to score. Uh, I just seen him fall, and I guess he hurt his um, his uh, thigh. But I don't know. He's he's in the having fun. Okay. <laughs> like he won.